Prescott Van Meyer III, sommeliering from home. Today's episode, another one in our $5 treasure series. Today, Smirnoff Vodka. So this kind of flew under the radar in a technicality. Normally Smirnoff comes in at a right around $6, but we got this on sale. So we're still gonna put in the $5 treasure series. I just don't want you to be disappointed if it comes in at $6.39 at your local liquor store. Now we do call this a $5 treasure, and if you happen to get it with a five finger discount, well, you know, I won't judge. I've done much, much worse things. Now, what's interesting about today is that some of the $5 treasures you would find out there are some pretty obscure varieties, some, some names you haven't heard of, but Smirnoff, well, that's pretty well known in all circles of drinking. And I know what you're gonna say in the comments. Am I getting the pronunciation right? I don't know. Is it Smirnoff? Is it Smirnoff? I don't know. Smirnoff? Smirnoff. It's not Smirnoff. No one has ever said it's Smirnoff. So we'll stay away from that pronunciation. But Smirnoff is very well known. The point is, this is recipe number 21. The recipe that became famous and is the clear vodka that you find in all Smirnoff, Smirnoff bottles everywhere. Continuing tradition since 1864, been around a while. Also said it's been filtered 10 times. So, I don't know what they're trying to filter out. 10 seems like a lot. They don't really tell you what the filter is made of, you know? Those crazy Russians could be bear skin. That actually sounds like that would be a bonus. You don't want to filter through an otter skin or seal skin. No, you want bear skin, not foreskin. Definitely not bear's foreskin. Those things are the size of a floppy leather purse. That's gross. Anyways, getting back to this. Now this actually is made in America, so despite tensions in the geopolitical situation going on right now, fret not, American made and American drunk. Drink. You will drink it in America. Um, well, I don't know where you are drinking it from. We have a lot of international people. Phoebe will always have two or three of these bottles on her person at all times. Yeah, in various stages of consumption too. So, very familiar with Smirnoff. I mean, it kind of became a game at one point. Wonder how many I'm gonna find on her this time as I was told to put all the coats upstairs. I was given a lot of chores, a lot of errands to do when Phoebe came over and it was Abby and Phoebe time. Very special time for them and a lot of detail oriented tasks that I had to do. Happier times. Well, let's get into tasting. Boy, that Russian engineering, <laughs> or lack thereof. Bottoms up. Well, it is a very clean flavor. Obviously, that's what you want with your vodka. Don't want any contaminants. Gotta hand it to them, even though it's coming in this little plastic bottle, does not have that sort of medicinal antiseptic quality that I found in some other less expensive vodkas, McCormick's. So I guess I take back the 10 times filtered clean that they had in the bottle. They seem to certainly filter out anything that would be negatively associated with the flavor, but they couldn't quite take out the anger <laughs> that you're gonna feel as this hits your lips in your system. I'm wondering what kind of anger it is. Is it Russian mob anger or is it Chechen mob anger? Maybe we'll edit that out. My apologies to any Chechen mobsters. And Dean, who has some real Chechen ties and who may or may not be dead. The shadowy figure outside my window recently, well, certainly is big and hulking like Dean. And I get it, Dean, I owe you some money. I'm getting it together, all right? It'll be a new year soon for this guy. My luck's turning around. <clears throat> Well, gotta say, for uh, this amount and for the sale, this was quite a nice little value bundle that they had together. Smirnoff, it was pretty smooth. Even this plastic bottle, 10 times filtered. I guess I believe you. Smirnoff, Smirnoff? <clears throat> Who would be drinking this? Uh, mobsters of all regions and countries. I mean, no particular area or country needs to be singled out. Also, Phoebe. I mean, it's like a Pavlovian response. Just posting this video, there's an 80% chance that she is swigging this down somewhere. So I'm gonna give this $5 treasure a thumbs up. This will blend very well in your cocktails and uh, well, it's not nearly as bad as McCormick's. And as I mentioned before, if you're very stern on that $5, that's all you got. You're gonna have to find this on sale. Otherwise it's McCormick's for you. And for that, may God have mercy on your soul. And your liver. Good luck, PV3 Nation.